me, Renee. I'm back. <coughs> Sorry. And I've decided today to do a little current reading, or a current reading update. As usual, I'm reading more than one book. Why would you just read one book? Well, at least that's a question I ask myself. So I always have more books on the go. <coughs> and uh, yeah, well, that's a thumbs up. This is actually also my recently, most recently started book. It is A Million to One by Adiba Jagirdar. This is a historical YA novel set, it's a heist set on, as you might have guessed, well, you just hear, uh, you just see a boat, but yeah, it's set on Titanic. Uh, so, like, so far I'm liking it. I am not loving it, but I'm liking it. So I'm, uh, I'm not DNFing it yet, but yeah. I suppose when I heard about this being like a heist set on Titanic, I felt like, oh, it's going to be fast-paced. So far, it's not that fast-paced, but then again, because you have American heist to be fast-paced books, but then again, this book, like, <clears throat> I'm just, well, yeah, I am six chapters into it, uh, but so far, they haven't made it onto the Titanic yet, so I'm thinking, yeah, there's still time for things to be picked up, so, yeah. As I said, not loving it, not hating it, I'm not doing nothing it, I'm just reading it slowly. <clears throat> and then we have my purse book. I always have at least one book in my purse, and sometimes I end up taking more books in my purse because that's what I do. I started A Treacherous Curse by Diana Rayburn last fall, I want to say. So it's been a little while. Why are you there? I don't know. Uh, and yeah, and I then you just kind of also started slightly again because I don't really quite remember that first chapter or like because I just read like one chapter a few pages so I kind of end up starting reading rereading it just recently. I'm liking it. But so far it's just kind of at the very beginning so not much has happened yet. So yeah I mean some books take you grab you from the first paragraph and first this book I'm liking it. I have to read more now. It's just kind of yeah a book. I'm not saying anything, it's, I'm just kind of reading it slowly. I kind of often seem to have like a book that I read slowly throughout the years, throughout the years, like throughout the year. Like whenever I, like I'm always reading several books and some, often some books I'm just kind of reading in one sitting, two sittings. And then I often have one book that I just kind of am reading a bit now, a, a, a bit, a week, a bit two weeks later, a bit, a bit next week. And yeah, kind of like that. So, yep. Yeah. Nothing wrong with that, that's just how it is. <clears throat> then we have a library book, Palestina, Fakta of Bakken, all about the situation in Palestine, in Norwegian. And yeah, I did borrow a lot of books about Israel and Palestine lately from the uh, library. I end up uh, returning the other books because I kind of thought, like, you know what, this book, it's not big, but I kind of feel like it kind of gives you a very good look at the situation, and it's, it's not like, it, yeah. It's a book that came out last year, so it's most recent than a lot of the other books. I'm not saying that I'm not going to read the other books, but I'm thinking that I'm just going to read this one and then, yeah, do the other ones afterwards. I mean, sometimes you kind of end up going to a library and being like, oh, I want all the books! And it's, I mean, it's great that library exists and you can borrow all the books you want, at least in my library, you can borrow as many books as you want. But at the same time, and yeah, it's great that it's free, at least here in Norway, depends on where you are, but here in Norway it's free. But at the same time, it's like, yeah, that just kind of makes you just borrow all the books, and then they just kind of sit on your shelf, gathering dust, in a way. So I suppose that's kind of like, yeah, even if the library books are available and free, I mean, you take a little self-reflection to think, like, do you really want to read this book now? Or in the next month. I mean, yes, you can. You can. Uh, sorry. You can uh, renew your loan. But still, like, do you want to renew a book for like half a year and then don't read at all? Yeah. <coughs> sorry. <coughs> and then lastly, um, uh, listening and almost finishing. Finishing, almost finished. 
an audiobook. It's called Her Majesty's League of Remarkable Ladies. It's, um, you know what, I'm just going to bring it up to Edward because I want to have that on uh, the right way. And the author is called Alison D. Stigert. And uh, yeah, so I found this like last year, like I found this just browsing for that kind of cover, like, oh, cool cover. Oh, female spikes, cool. And I started listening to it last week. And um, like the first few chapters were very good. And then kind of started meandering. Like you were told that they were like, yeah, you, you jumped over the learning to be a spy. You just kind of told like something like, now she knows to be a spy, how it is to be a spy. And, um, yeah, um, I saw, suppose, in a way, I've come mentally done of this, so I have, like, finished, like, I've just, well, about one, one week, one uh, hour left of the audiobook, so I think I'm just gonna finish it. And, and honestly, I don't really think that it's just a bad book. Like, it might be more, like, if you're, because it's written for, like, I would say it's, like, a middle grade, middle grade, early YA book. So I would say, like, if you're 10, 11, 12, you might love this very much. But for me, this kind of, yeah, it didn't really read for all ages. It was an interesting book, but it wasn't, I need to read it. I need to read it again. I need to read all the books. No, it, it's a fine book, anyway. Uh, but I'm, I'm finishing it because I kind of want to. And I'm so close to finishing it. So, yeah. Sometimes when I'm, like, feeling, Ugh, about books, I do not them. Sometimes I just kind of read them slowly. So, yeah. And, uh, yeah. I'm just also might, might just give you a little hint. I'm going to start The Red Palace, like, this weekend. Because I have it from the library. And it's from, um, it's from a library loan. Like, interlibrary loan. And then you can't renew them. And my, uh, I have to return it on, um, Thursday. Tuesday. I always mix up those two. Monday, Monday, Thursday, Thursday. Yeah. I have to return it to the 13th. So I'm going to start it maybe today, maybe tomorrow. At least start it soon. And uh, yeah. So that's that, really, my little update for today. I hope you like this. And if you have any interesting reads you're currently reading, talk about those. And I hope you have a nice weekend. And uh, I'll see you soon. Bye.